Dear fellow coders, welcome to One Little Coder. This is day six of eight days of Streamlit, where I teach you to build a Streamlit application every single day. Today's tutorial is going to be slightly small because this is going to build on top of something that I've already built and then made a tutorial about. So I'll link that YouTube description. I'll link the tutorial in the YouTube description. But what we are going to see today is a new feature that has been very recently launched on Streamlit which is a camera module. So Streamlit has released a camera module and we are going to make a pencil sketch of the camera snap. So the pencil sketch image is what I'm going to link in the YouTube description because I already have an application like this where you can just, you know, drag and drop an image. Like for example, I can drag and drop um, this popular cricket player in India, Virat Kohli, and you can see the pencil sketch of it. So this is an application that I've already made long back. I have got the code on my GitHub and then I link that in the YouTube description. But what we are going to do today is instead of having this drag and drop upload photo feature we are going to have a camera module there and that camera module is a very very recent uh, i think it's just a couple of days old so it was introduced in streamlit 1.4.0 so if you have streamlit 1.4.0 you would have the streamlit camera module so what is this camera module you have you have like a small uh, module where you can take a snap and then that snap is converted into an image which you can use it and you can read the documentation for more information for example you can yeah so you you actually you can see like you know there is a computer and these things uh, if you want to read more about it you can go to the documents and then read about it i'll just close it for now so you can see the code is quite simple you just have to import streamlit as st and then you have got um, you have got camera module where you take the picture and then you're going to use that picture so what i'm going to do is i'm not going to open my id even i'm going to show you how am i going to change my existing code base which is which is powering this particular code base to to make the camera module so this is this is how my existing code uh, the app looks like so if i go here this is the this is the github repository and for me to make some change i don't need a local uh, i don't need a local id because thanks to github.dev so i'm going to open github.dev and i'll just quickly give you a very quick walkthrough of the code base here like what what's happening behind this um this code base it's it's quite simple if you actually see um it, it's loading so let me let me open this yeah so as you can see that it has very simple modules uh, so one you have you are importing streamlit streamlit for a web app and camera now and then you have got a uh, numpy for some uh, image processing and you have got a pil um sorry pillow for image processing again and you have got cv for a uh, computer vision so you have got these libraries and then you're going to do the gray the grayscale or pencil sketch effect using um, cv and numpy that's what that's what is happening here and then if you see this this is all the ui component you have got the title you have got uh, you've got certain details there and this is this is where we actually collect the user collect the user input which is an image so let me make it big so this is where you collect the user input you can see there is a sidebar where we have got a file uploader we just saw file uploader in a couple of days back so this is where we restrict the user to upload only jpeg jpg or png image and this is the place we are going to make change and we are trying to you know make sure that a user upload something if they have not uploaded something we are going to say you have not uploaded anything and once they upload an image now we are going to do all the image processing for example you can see that the image is going to be opened with pillow and then that has been called with this with this function which is going to convert into a sketch pencil sketch and we are also going to display the input image and also display the output image and then finally we have got um, we have got this amazing result so we're going to make a couple of changes in this like first first thing first i want to like right now if you see this application it's it looks like this like if, if you upload an image um it it comes like one by one but i would probably prefer it in um, you know side by side as two columns so the first change that i'm going to make here is i'm going to make two columns that's a, that's the first thing i'm going to do i to say one comma two equals st dot columns i think it might be still small so let me let me make it slightly big yeah one comma two dot columns um i'm going to make two columns and then with one i'm going to give this and then with two 
I'm going to give this. So this is you must be by this time familiar with uh, you know how are we showing the columns. So this is this is how we show the columns. I'm going to just go committed. Um, just what is the message? So columns, added columns, and publish it. And then go here and then come back and see by this time it should start updating because it's pulling the code from github so right at this point you can see that we have got two columns so like we have a one left hand column and the right hand column left hand is where we show the original image that has been uploaded and the right hand side is where um, we are going to show um show the show the output image the pencil sketch now i'm going to make a little change in the title because i want to show that it is updated with streamlit camera module maybe an emoticon might help so how, how do you put a camera yeah we have a camera module and save it uh, once again like added edited title i can say commit it go back here and see it should ideally pull the app again like you can see it is pulling the app again and you can you can see the title so at this point our app is fine all we have to do is now change this place where we are uploading a picture to a camera module where somebody can take a snap so go back to the code and comment this input code right now that we have got and then i'm going to simply say um changing okay uh, collecting the the input image from user camera um and uh, i'm going to show you that we are going to use the same name so that it's easier st.camera input and then we need a label and the label is going to say take a pic of you to be sketched out okay so that looks like a decent name um, like the label to explain people what's going to happen here and then we're going to collect it in file image and we are just making sure that there is something in the file image then we are going to do things otherwise we are not going to do things so um i mean like we there are different ways to write this like instead of saying file image is none we can just simply say if file image is um then we can have all these condition and then if um if 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 like okay instead of me saying that i would probably change the code so we can ideally do this uh, which is take all these components here okay and remove this none part and add this components here and in the else part i can add this so just to say quickly what what changes i've done so earlier what i was checking is if file image is none which means if the file image is not present i was um, i was trying to display a message that looked like this which says st.write you have not uploaded image but um, but for brevity for simplicity you don't have to say if file image is not none like you don't have to say like this so what you can actually do is you can simply say if file image which means if file image is uploaded then do this if file image is not uploaded which is the else case then you do this part um, so this is again a little bit of refactoring from my old code that i wrote couple of months back but again i think you you get the idea right so what is the change that i made so if you want me to quickly show you what is the change that i made um this is the change so initially the code looked like this i said if file image is none if nothing is uploaded then do this the, um if if something is uploaded which is the else case then do this thing i'm just flipping it around and then removing this none part like we don't we don't need this so now we are flipping the logic and then doing like this which is yeah which is if file image if anything is uploaded make a pencil sketch otherwise just just give this image information uh, save it i think the code looks fine uh, hopefully i didn't mess up with indentation anywhere and i'm going to say updated with camera module and send it and then let's go here and then wait for it to change and then you can see at this point i've already given rights and uh, you can see my monitor and uh, the, the the file is uploaded so you take a picture here and ideally it should after you take a picture it should it should show the rest rest of the rest of the place where you have the image so i'm going to i'm going to take a favorite picture of everybody which is which is the minion so i'm going to take a picture as you can see i've taken a picture and after we take a picture you can see that we have got the input image and we have got output image and then this is using streamlit camera module that's it you can download the sketch images if you want 
um like i've not implemented the tweet or share button yet but um if you want you can do that as well so let me clear out it once again and i'm going to show you the first thing is if you before you do this thing you have to give a uh, camera rights like your browser might ask you if you're trying it on phone or anywhere but again like i just show the minion okay. let me show it without my hand so that minion is minion is available hello minion take a picture and then see that is a nice look right so we have got minion minion and then we have got a pencil sketch that's it um this 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 module is uploaded now like for example this is uploaded i can just change back to my github repository and then show you that this is right now uploaded so you can you can see this application um that takes picture of you uh, from the camera module and then it shows the pencil sketch again like there are enhancements that you can do you can you can have both both the features right you can either upload an image or you can upload um, you can upload um, the the picture so you can you can do either of these two but uh, but yeah so it's up to you whatever you want to do but right now we have this we have this module that takes a very nice picture and gives us a pencil sketch um so hopefully if you take your pencil sketch please let me know in the comment section or you know anywhere on social media share it with me love to see how it looks but otherwise thank you minion for uh, for posting us um like in this in this particular tutorial um i hope you don't mind that i've used you in this tutorial otherwise um i hope all of you stay safe and um we have got through one more days of eight days of streamlit let me know in the comment section if you have any feedback for me otherwise stay safe take care of your family see you in the next video